Hello po, welcome back sa ating channel. I hope you all are doing well. Uh, may babasahin po tayo ngayon na uh, tanong. Uh, ito po ay mga random uh, questions po na ating babasahin. Why do narcissists isolate their victims or their target? Isolating their partner is a part of the process of making their partner dependent only on the narc for support. This make it easier for the narc to get away with their normal control manipulative tactics. Kasi nga naman, kapag wala ka ng support system, you are isolated. Wala na yung narc na ang mundo mo. At they are dangerous. Nababago nila, napapaniwala ka nila, nababago nila yung utak mo. Kaya nga maraming biktima na alam nila na they are in a toxic situation but they, do, they stay Uh, hindi sila umaalis kasi wala na eh. Hindi na nila alam kung ano ang ang sitwasyon nila from a uh, uh, normal perspective kasi nga yung mind nila is parang bumaliktad. If the narc succeeds in isolating their partner or victim from friends and family, the partner finds that they do not really have a support structure outside of the narc house. Mm -hmm. This is what the narc wants. Sila mag-operate. Uh, alisan ka nila ng yung support system. Unti-unti yan nila na binibrainwash nila yung mga friends mo, family mo. So, unti-unti ring nawawala sila. Na yung mga tao sa paligod didn't know what, what is really happening inside home, inside, no? So, they don't know what is happening. Otherwise, it is difficult for the narc to keep full control. It's all about control po, remember. Kaya nga, sabi ko po, dun sa mga nakaraang video ko, if you are with the narcissist, you are not allowed to be yourself. Kasi they want to be in control 100%. As there is a risk, the support structure could talk some sense into the partner of potentially leaving the narc or standing up for themselves. But how does the narc do this? Kaya ka ina-isolate kasi nga natatakot sila na somewhere, somehow may makakausap ka na to open up your mind. Alam mo yon At malalaman mo na, ah, this is not normal. At doon, makukulik mo yung thoughts mo and you will see the reality. Aalis ka. Yun ang iiwasan ng nar narcissist na mangyari. Yung magising ka. The narc will then slowly but surely do and say certain things for the partner to cut ties with their friends and family, burn those bridges. Sometimes the narc will ask you to move with them somewhere far from your people. Maybe another city, state, country to make you physically distant. Or perhaps the narc carefully concocts a plan to push you away from your people. For example, they might be passive-aggressive Every time you want to meet up with your best friend, which can cause you to repeatedly break your plans to meet with the person up to keep peace with the narc. To the point where you start falling out with your friends as they find you unreliable. At this point, the narc might say few things to make you think the person was not a good friend anyway. Or there you go, friendship ruined. Or the narc might even triangulate you with your best friend by saying how nice she is or her. Her hair is pretty, halimbawa. Nothing absurdly inappropriate but at the same time striking at your insecurities and causing you to think maybe she and the narc might end up having an affair. So they are starting planting a seed on your, on your mind to provoke uh, jealousy, insecurity. So, kunyari, uh, pupurihin niya yung ano mo, yung, yung friend mo. Kasabihin niya na, ah, uh, yung, yung, yung friend mo, maganda, or sexy, ganun. O kaya, friend mo, um, mas may muscle kisa sa'yo, yung mga ganun. So, ikaw, unti kang, parang magkakaroon ka ng, ano, Imagine guy, narcissist playing your mind. Lahat po ng mga galaw nila ay calculated. Sadya po yun, it's a part of their game. Na hindi mo siya namamalayan kasi it looks natural. 
it looks normal, pero unti-unti nandun ka na napupunta ka sa bangin, napupunta ka sa trap nila. Striking at your insecurities and causing you to think maybe she and the nerd might end up having an affair one day. In which case, you start feeling animosity towards your friend from the seed of doubt planted by the narc. My, on my experience naman yung narc, kasi yung ano daw, yung, yung kaibigan ko, I'm not buying their bullshit kasi I know my friends. Alam ko, yung totoong kaibigan ko, I know them. So I'm not buying their bullshit. And you decide your own account to let friendship wither away. You see, creativity has no limits when it comes to ways approach of the night pulling strings to distance you from your people. Kasi nga, they are puppet master. Every time na they pull string, string, you also move according to what they want. May yun, napaka, napakagaling nila magmanipulate. And the whole process is like the story of boiling frog to death. If you drop a frog in hot water, it simply jump out and survive. However, if you put a frog in a pot and turn the temperature up slowly to the point water is boiling, the frog will not jump out but will instead sit still and die because the frog's body slowly acclim acclimatizes itself to the ever-increasing temperature and did not realize it was heading towards certain doom or death. Yan. Hindi mo siya namamalayan talaga. And I was there, I was on that situation that I didn't realize what is happening. Hindi mo kasi siya makikina because you, you are being manipulated eh. Kasi they pretend they are, they are on your side. They're smiling, they are on your best of interest. So, ingat po. That's what narcs do. They turn the temperature up slowly but surely and you unknowingly acclimatize yourself to be uh, to the increasing temperature until it's too late and you have no way out. Jump out of the path before it's too late. I'm glad the narc discarded me. It's a blessing in disguise kasi I know that time talaga na Wala na akong, wala na akong, kumbaga, I, I give my 100%. Attack it comes from nowhere. It doesn't make any sense talaga kasi, alam mo yung parang, alam mo na gawa-gawa lang. Alam niyo po yung narcissist. They are using people like an object. Kapag uh, sumasabit yung plan nila sa kanilang buhay, ay hindi mapukos sa kanila yung attention kasi they're scared of truth to come out and uh, truth are for them. Sobrang painful sa kanila yun. Uh, they are terrified of the truth. So, they will manage everything they can to look for a scapegoat na para madivert yung focus sa kanila. So, they will look for a target. They will attack the target for, for nothing. And part po yun ng madness nila ng kanilang game. So, nagkataon lang na ikaw yung buntunan nila. Ikaw yung narcissist um, supply. Buntunan din nila ng negativity. Alam mo yun, yung mga, lang naman, naman yung mga imbento lang. Mas madali kasi sa kanilang gumawa ng kasinungalingan kesa yung maging accountable sila sa mali nila. It's too much for them. They will uh, look for a scapegoat. I hope po na may natutunan tayo. So that is, that's what a narcissist do sa nilang ano po, partner or target na gusto, gusto nilang i-isolate. And that oh. is para alisan ka ng kanil support system. At doon, mag-ano ka doon, mag-stick ka lang doon sa narcissist. Kasi they play, remember, they they are puppets uh, master. Mayroon silang pinupush na every time they push, uh, you, you calculated po. They are master on it kasi they're doing it since, ano pa sila. Kung baghasa na sila doon. Kasi I think since since child, ano nila, nung kabataan nila, eh, ganun, na, ganun na nila ginagawa. So, they are master on it. Remember, guys, kapag ginagawa mo ang isang bagay ng paulit-ulit, it comes a natural to you na hindi mo kailangan ng effort. And remember, they don't have any empathy, kaya hindi sila nakakaramdam ng guilt or any remorse. That's how they are. Kaya nga, hindi mo talaga, hindi mo talaga maaano sila. Eh, ganun na po yung talagang pattern nila. And remember po, you are not the first sa buhay ng narcissist na yun na inabuso nila. Marami ng, maraming nauna sa'yo and the pattern repeat itself. Kasi that's how they are. They don't change. They, do, they, they just change the victim or the target. 
So yung the pattern will continue hanggang sa hanggang sa mamatayan sila yung mga narcissist kasi they don't change. The more they age, the more they get a worst. So jump out from that path as early as you can. Learn the narcissistic personality disorder and narcissistic abuse. They are not worth it of your of your time. They are controlling you and you don't have any anything good na ano naghihintay sa you with the narcissist. No. Pag nagstay ka sa narcissist, you you are digging hole for your for your parang hinahanda mo yung deathbed mo kapag kasama mo yung narcissist. So, I hope po may natutunan tayo and love yourself first. Unahin natin po ang ating mga sarili bago ibang tao. Bye.